yo, it's on like Donkey Kong. It's on like Donkey Kong. You know, I'm just doing my thing like a chicken wing. It's on like butter popcorn around this place. Hell to the hell yeah. Chilling like a villain. Right on with the right on. We keep on trucking. Keep it on, keep it on. Here we go. Vertical, vertical and breathing above the dirt. Yes, I am. Even though shit sucks, but I'm not gonna talk about depressing, depressing things, cause I know what I know. All I know, peeps, is that later I'm gonna put on some good fucking music and whatever, and I'm gonna drink some Budweiser. I'm gonna drink some Genesee, and I'm gonna. Uh, watch some TV and uh, order me up a lasagna dinner. Actually, uh, shit. Uh, uh, uh. Did I say dinner? I mean supper. I'm gonna get me a lasagna supper, and guess what? I got some kick-ass hot pepper flakes for my lasagna. I'm gonna get the garlic bread. I thought about slapping some onions in the lasagna. That sounds damn good. Green peppers might work. Olives would actually be good. As a matter of fact, I was thinking about getting a. Um, <coughs> I, was, I ain't even in the mood to eat. I just want to work on this. I was thinking about getting a meatball sub. For real, like a meatball sub and have them put onion and olives in it. Black olives and onions in the meatball sub with cheese. Ooh, that sounds good. Toasted on the bun. A little mayo maybe on there. Some people like banana pepper with the mayo with the meatball and the sauce. Shit, I put a little mayo on that bitch with the tomato sauce. The olives and the onions on it, mozzarella, don't sound half bad, that's what's up, pretty much, pretty much people, ain't too shabby, ain't too shabby, man, you know, that was fucked up, that was messed up, tripped out how Yellow Groove did me like that, I mean, I'm going to get me a black girlfriend here in the next year, I think, and maybe we're going to get married. I want a Letitia. I want a Natasha. I want a uh, La Latoya. I want a cute, pretty Latoya. I want some chocolate titties in my life. But that's yeah, just me. But everyone each his own. But, you know, uh, you know, I'm, I can get down with it, man. I'm, I'm going to try some high, um, uh, Hennessy. I never had Hennessy. I think once I had it, I can't remember. But, uh, find me a a, a little uh, black sugar honey one day. I was talking on the phone to the. I'm trying. Last night I called up this girl. She's older. She's like in her 70s, man. She's old. I gave her some flowers last night after my videos. But she's a lot of interest. She was liking me for a minute. She bought me lunch at lunch at uh, Chinese last year and gave me a kiss and she she actually gave me a kiss and I kissed her a quick kiss in the car and took me off by surprise but she's old and just lately she hasn't been in I think I, I, I said something that offended her or something I was drunk I, she's not she's old enough to be my great grandma probably I mean I need someone closer to my age Give me a lasagna supper later, I think. I could do the old salami routine. My mom's Italian. She went down and got some salami. For Actually, it's good salami, but that's more of a lunch thing. <coughs> I don't feel like cooking. I don't know. I'll figure something out. Back on the grindstone tomorrow. I'm married around back to work. <coughs> I haven't seen Carl Kish, man. I he he's kind of goofy though. He's oh, man. He he could sing though, man. I can't sing like he. He's a better singer than me. But I unsubscribed to him today. I'll admit it. He's a weirdo. I mean, he's a he's he. What he is is he's a thirsty YouTube wannabe famous, just like everybody else. That's all he is. He just wants money. He just wants to get rich off YouTube, and I don't care. You should keep your money, people. I don't care. I work hard for my money. I'm going to keep working for it. 
until I die. No one said it's easy making a buck or two, but hey, at least it's an honest, I got an honest job. I ain't underemployed, I'm not underpaid. Oh, shit. Uh, time for a Slim Jim almost, shit. Yeah, why not? Does a job every time. I'm about to put some. I think honestly though, I'm gonna join a dating site, black dating site. I think I want me a black girl. I've been with like four or five of them. Dilly dallied around with a couple in my life. It's been it's, I'm way overdue to have some tender love and care. I'm way overdue, man. It's been too long. I've been lonely. I'm I'm ready to settle down with some girl. The girl that likes the rodeo, the drink, and have a good old time. You know, just chill and just have a good time. Cuddle, like cuddle, watch movies, and have some good time, man. I'm, I love to give flowers to girls. I'm a nice dude. It seems like nowadays a lot of girls like guys that are rebels and mean and outlanders and uh, treat them dirty. And I never would treat a girl dirty. I could guarantee you that. I mean, I, 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 I cherish and appreciate girls way too much. I idolize girls. I would never not treat a girl the way she should be treated. I would treat a girl with excellence and decency, mannerism, and gentleman-like characteristics and gentleman-like uh, qualities. That That's just me, you know. I don't have no respect for dudes and guys that lay hands on a girl. I don't have no respect because any guy that would touch or hit a girl would be the same kind of guy that would uh, abuse animals, in my opinion. And they're jackasses. They're pussies. That's it. I would never in a million years lay a hand. A girl can even stab me and I wouldn't even touch her. And that's just me. I might say, back up, back up, hold on, hold up a little bit, you know. Settle down, settle down, but I'm not going to hit her. I would never hit a girl. I don't care what the situation is. That's just me. Now, if we're in a kinky situation, which I hope one day, and a girl in the bedroom, even though I'm submissive, and a girl and a girl's like, "Well, pull my hair. I'll pull a girl's hair if it turns her on." But you know, oftentimes I'm submissive. But I'll be dominant if the girl, if that's what's going to turn her on, but within limits and boundaries. probably shouldn't even be talking about it because I don't think I'm going to have a girl. I mean, Anna, Cray Girl's a beautiful girl. She has a beautiful body. Even though she's not black, I don't look, I like brunettes and blondes. I'm open-minded. I think all girls are pretty. Indians, Chinese, Asians. Shit, I've seen pretty Mexican girls. I've seen pretty Latinos. I've seen a lot of different spectrums of different cultures and races of pretty girls. It's not just black girls, but my preference is black and blondes, but you don't have to fit that category to be in my life. I mean, I'm as long as you have a good personality. I look at personality, but above that, I look at looks. I look at appearance and how attractive a girl is. That's what I look at. And I love moles and beauty marks. I mean, those are sexy to me. I don't like the damn warts and little marks right by their nose. I think that's atrocious and nasty. And screw that. I don't like real over fat girls that have triple chins. Screw that. I'm not going to go there. I'm only going to fall for like average to beautiful or skinny athletic girls or even chubby girls that are chubby but carry their weight well. You know, chubby, but they still can be cute. You know, I like chubbiness, but thick bone. Like chubby but not fat and gross. I don't like a girl that has blubber like a, like a whale. That's whale shit. <laughs> That's dog shit and bat shit, horse shit and hog shit and dog shit. <laughs> I ain't going there with that. But I have, I, you know, I ain't picky. I ain't choicey. But by and large, I know what I like, and I'm not gonna settle for anything and everything either. I'm not desperate. I mean, I am to a point desperate, but I'm not that desperate. <sighs> Cheers. This is some real strong shit. 
kind of like that cam of black silver ice. Later. About to chug it. Long I hate these long veins. Ow, my shoulder. See you when I see you.